there is controversy in AI. On one corner, reasoning models, LRMs, DeepSeek R1, you know, your thinking models, the ones that have been blowing up benchmarks like crazy. You got them over here. And then on the other corner, you have Apple with their new paper, The Illusion of Thinking, saying that maybe these reasoning models don't reason as much as we thought. The internet has been blowing up around the illusion of thinking paper. They're saying that AI is dead, even though we're using it all the time. <laughs> They're saying all this stuff, AI is crumbling down, they don't think at all. And there's also from the academic community and from developers, there's been a lot of criticism of the illusion of thinking paper. A lot of people are saying that, hey, maybe their testing process isn't exactly maybe what it should have been. They use something called Tower of Hanoi, which is super all over all sorts of data sets. So maybe it wasn't a good thing to begin with, but also them saying, hey, it's failing at Tower of Hanoi. It's failing at solving you know, this relatively simple problem. Actually, it takes thousands of steps. So maybe these LRMs aren't saying that they can't solve the problem. Maybe it's it's just too long. They're saying, I don't want to solve the problem. It's too much effort. Seriously, it's it seems like LRMs are maybe prone to saying, that's too much work. I think I don't do you know BS. It's, it's absolutely nuts. It's insane. So this is my take. I think the critics are actually kind of mostly right. I think that the illusion of thinking paper has a few core problems. And I think that large reasoning models do think. And I elaborate that in, in another video. I do think though, that the illusion of thinking paper is really useful because it starts to define what thinking is. Thinking, reasoning, these have been a semantic issue in AI since Jump Street forever. And we need to codify what those actually mean. And while the illusion of thinking paper isn't perfect, it starts to make a step in the direction of us defining what thinking is. This is groundbreaking stuff. You need to watch the video. It's linked in the description. I'll see you there.